on the 8th of November. Matthew said. These first attachments have come in from Filma Rakoff. Now we can see on the screen, can't we, the halo and chemtrails. The <laughs> He went on to say, The white object, dark shadows. Now I just want to say as well, that every day, we're going to try and get these images out, produce them onto video, to show that they are still chemtrailing, and the skies are being covered up to hide the truth. Oh please, I hope there are no birds in this clip or healthy trees, because they just can't exist. They are being killed off by chemtrailing. You must have a bird and tree simulator. Look, I'm really sorry Matt. You've lucked out again. I keep telling those darn birds and trees that they just have to die for you. But you know what? They just don't pay any attention. And it also looks as though the chemtrail squadron decided to take the day off as well. Now, I want you to watch and listen very carefully to what Matt says and does in this next clip which is from about 3 minutes and 25 seconds into his video. Now my belief is that they are covering the skies to hide those objects that are incoming. This information has been suppressed for many years now and the truth has to come out as Nibiru is a huge object that's reflecting in our skies. Let me move to the next photograph. This image was taken just a short time afterwards. You can again see this chemtrail, this white object, and this rainbow. Again, it's a huge halo. All again is ash, coal, blood, everything that's been sprayed in the skies dark shadows inside this halo. If this was removed, we would see objects in the heavens. Did you hear that? He definitely says, if this was removed, we would see objects in the heavens. Now again, watch the next clip carefully, very carefully, and see what image he decides to show us at about 9 minutes and 30 seconds into this video of his. I think you'll be surprised. During the time about half past 9, he noticed the white light source in the sky to the right hand side. Look again at that strange reflection on that chemtrail line. This poison that's in our atmosphere. Now, many people still state as well, no chem planes, just these strange cloud formations that just appear in our atmosphere. So I believe again, our atmosphere is full of toxic poisons being spread across our skies to hide those reflections from them heavily bodies. Now, this image is of a fairly clear sky, but where are the bloody objects in the heavens the chemtrails from earlier on are supposedly covering up? Congratulations, Matt. You just managed to debunk your own video. Well, that's it for this video. But I will continue to do my work and produce more videos and stand strong for all of you in the community. Because I really, really believe it is important to get the truth out there.